Alright guys, full generation here. Back with our next video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for low end devices players. As you all know I'm a low end device player and these are my settings and I think it's the best settings for all low end devices. So I'm gonna be showing you all my graphics and audio settings first this is my graphics quality settings low graphics to reduce performance low graphics to improve performance and prevent overheating or conserve power high frame rate for smoother gameplay i use dynamic style is the brightest style so i use the dynamic style because it's the brightest master volume straight up 100 ui volume straight up sfx volume straight up music i don't use no music volume i don't use my voice chat on 30 microphone on 40 ambient volume zero guys every body right now should put the ambient volume on zero you hear the footsteps clear and more precise so please put your ambient volume to zero now guys we're going on to sensitivity these are my sensitivity settings i don't use link speed i don't use link sensitivity with resolution uh, scope I use gradually switch while aliasing it's more consistent it feels more natural these are my camera sensitivity 65 standard sensitivity 65 my EDS sensitivity is 63 and everything else alright guys firing sensitivity and 64 my EDS sensitivity and 63 and everything else guys I don't recommend using gyroscope on low-end devices because it's much you wouldn't be able to see sometimes with the aim shake on the gyroscope all right guys we're going on to basics I'm going to show you all my FOV and my settings guys I do not recommend sync ads fov to scope zoom on low-end devices with this new sync ads fov to scope zoom it's only better for ipads and tablets big screen if you're using a phone it's not recommended it's not optimized damage number I don't use it because I have a low-end device, it causes more lag. ADS, I use tap to ADS. I use tap crouch while sprinting. Uh, always sprint, 70. Gyroscope off. Camera FOV, 65. Guys, you can keep your FOV between 60 to 71 on low-end devices. So you could see in corners between 60 to 65. And it's not too far where you can't see enemy at full ranges. And my final FOV is 100%. I use it at 100% because it gives you better movement. You see more of your gun and you see more of your character hands. Marker settings, objective marker, scale 100%. Opacity, I think I'm not saying that word correctly. Anyways, it's on 40 item marker 100% opacity 75% minimap global settings 94 opacity capacity 100% map zoom 71 icon zoom 100% alright guys that is it for my settings